welcome to Stanley, uh, a shed here at the University of the West of England, where we turn this into this. What we do in this, this wonderful place, this shed, is we transform uh, dirty water into clean drinking water. Um, and one of the things uh, which is really important in the research that we do is trying to address some of the problems associated with shortage of uh, drinking water. So, for instance, over one billion people on planet Earth do not have access to uh, a clean or secure water supply. And in fact, over two to three billion people have problems not just with drinking water, but with sanitation as well. Um, and, uh, you know, poor water, uh, dirty water, water that is unfit for human consumption uh, also is one of the main drivers of, of disease in developing worlds. Okay, so um, this system is, is actually quite quite simple. We, we draw water in from outside, um, dirty water, um, and we collect that dirty water in these very large blue containers here. And that's the first part of that process, is getting all uh, the gunk and the particulates to settle in this container. We then draw water from this container and pass it through a screening filter. And this screening filter helps to remove um, some uh, smaller particles even further. So particles that are maybe 200 times bigger than bacteria, you know, the, the bits you can see. We then uh, use um, a very uh, novel biocide that we've developed here at UWE uh, and we can use this biocide to help us kill and remove um, the bacteria or any bacteria that might be present within the water and that's really important if you want to turn dirty water into drinking water we need to kill the bacteria or any bacteria that's in there. Um, we have um, another system here uh, which is another type of filter these are called membranes and this helps us remove really really tiny uh, particles uh, that are maybe two or three times bigger than bacteria. And again, we can use the biocide that we've developed here at UWE uh, to, to, to kind of dose the water before it enters this system and after it leaves this system. And the water is passed along all of this pipe work here and you can see we have lots of dials and lots of sensors and these help us understand how the water is changing throughout this entire process and we can collect all of that information uh, using computers and that helps us to understand the process. And the wonderful thing uh, about this journey is it eventually arrives in this other blue container here and inside this blue container we have wonderful clean drinking water which is fit for human consumption and of course the proof uh, I suppose is in the drinking so I'll just go in here and help myself there you go pure drinking water sourced and bottled at Ewing cheers not too bad